look everybody I look like one of officer 401's old videos remember those where he's sitting in his charger all the time videoing from his charger and all you could ever see was his hand doing this stuff talking about this and everything but uh I am headed to the Dallas area actually Grenville uh, to uh, participate in the Dallas convoy rumor is that Ted Nugent is going to be in this one so I'm on my way up there it'd be instantaneous for y'all unless something happens on the way there boom How long you been here? How long y'all been here? About 30 minutes. About 30 minutes. Yeah, I've been down there at the QT waiting to come up here. Yeah. Look at y'all. They left around 10 in, in Weatherford. Yeah. Okay. Yep. So maybe around noon? Yep. I don't know. Yep. I'm thinking about then. They're slow rolling. They're going slow. I'll grab one. Thank you. Hey. Dana, Matt. Nice to meet you. Yeah. They're blowing their horns, everybody. <laughs> so what my plan is, is when they go on by, I'm gonna hand my flag off back to these kind folks. I'm gonna jump on the motorcycle and I'm gone. I'm chasing them down. Well, we got we got more people coming. So what's your what's your sign say? Oh, okay, cool. Yeah. I gotta go get the other one on camera. <laughs> Let their eye. Cool. <laughs> and here we come a more with some flags. Oop, got the thing in the way. Woo! They should be showing up. All right, <laughs> we got a we got a small crowd here on the overpass. Uh, it's getting bigger by the moment. People are walking up, uh, mostly retired folks like me, because everybody else is working. So uh, we have a dedicated few here that are still left. It is 140. I'm thinking uh, even slow rolling, they should have been here by now if it actually happened. Uh, kind of disappointing. We made a lot of truck drivers happy though. We're still standing here. I'm going to probably stick around at least two just to, to give them a adrenaline chance. I can't find anything online that says they took, they said they left at 10 o'clock from Weatherford, but uh, wow, wow. I, I can't see it taking them four hours even slow rolling to get to here. So, uh, I don't know what. Oh, do you know what the funny thing is? I, 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 I know there's people that are anti-American and stuff, but I was kind of surprised how many people flipped us off. I ain't kidding. I was a, a little dumbfounded how many people come by and flipped us off. Blew the horn and then flipped us off. Well, that was not totally disappointing. Uh, no convoy. Kind of surprised. Really surprised. Uh, met some people, though. Uh, gained a few subscribers. And made a bunch of truck drivers day. And I'm going to end it out looking like uh, Officer 401 again, like he used to way back in the, the beginning of his channel when all you ever saw was his hand on the steering wheel. So, I'm headed back home. Uh, like I said, it wasn't totally disappointing. Uh, did meet some people, did gain some subscribers, and definitely made a bunch of truck drivers' days. Boy, we were getting some honks and everything else, but uh, no convoy. Gave them better um, four and a half hours. If you can't get from Weatherford to, to the other side of Dallas in four and a half hours, there is something seriously wrong. 
So y'all know how it goes. <clears throat> if you've served or if you're currently serving in any military, if you're a firefighter, EMS, first responder, especially law enforcement, if you're in the healthcare industry battling out on the front lines of this pandemic trying to keep us well and putting yourself at risk, we appreciate everything you do for us and the sacrifices you and your families have made. Ladies, flash a stranger today. Boom.